bang! If you saw us on YouTube, you saw a very good version because the copyright reasons like the full link version of this. Patreon. Thank you have a Patreon, Patreon. Or channel memberships. Up in the description. The uncut versions there are. And at the end of this part, we will talk about the movie and review it. Okay. Yeah. Let's finish this movie, huh? Okay. Bang 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 bang. <laughs>
Five years later. Up. एक काम बाकी रह गया. क्या? Bang bang. Goddamn right. <laughs> Yeah, I love that song. Yeah. I'll play that thing on loop. Bang, bang. You know a lot of the words of it, of it too. I've listened oh, to it dozens and dozens of times. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. a great song. <laughs> All right. Bang, bang, indeed. Rick, yeah. Your initial thoughts of uh, Bang, bang. Um, I wish they had gone more with Night and Day serves you up a, a wonderful movie. Just replicate it. So, yeah. They. When you're doing a movie that's based on something else, you're either going to equal it, be lesser than, or be better than. And this was lesser than. Isn't that everything? Aren't those the only three options? Yeah, when you're ma when you're doing a remake, okay. it's either equal to, better than, or lesser than. Wasn't that an obvious statement? <laughs> Yeah, that's, I mean, that's the measuring point. Okay, it's just a versus versus. It's going to be better or worse well, or the same. Yeah, versus if you watch a something that's completely original, you mm. have nothing to compare it to, so it can't be better than or lesser than. It's going to be so. Yeah, I, compared I, to compared to Night and Day, Night and Day is a far superior. Film. I remember, uh, like I said, I we watched. I don't remember how long ago we did because we it was a long time ago. Night. It might have been a decade ago. Yeah, it, it, who knows? easily, easily. Um, which this film was, I believe, a decade. Yeah, it's a yeah. decade old. Um, so maybe it came out the year we saw it. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I that's the only time I had ever seen it. And I remember thinking it was fine. Um, entertaining, for sure. Definitely a different vibe. I, I agree with you. Uh, that one was obviously more of a, an American rom-com action movie. Yeah, it's a rom-com action this film. This one, I think I... With slight thriller. Um, and I think I, I remember people having concerns since you love that film so much, mm -hmm. not being able to disassociate the from impossible. it, which makes sense. Impossible. I get it. Um, I think I enjoyed this one more than you enjoyed, uh, obviously, It, um, just because I, I didn't realize, like, the only thing I remember, I, I remember there was a specific scene where she turned around and they did the bang bang thing yeah, on, yeah, on yeah. the motorcycle. I don't remember what that scene was about. And, and I didn't dislike it, it was just fine. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't recommend it and I wouldn't watch it again. Um, I'd say watch Night and Day. I, I would watch this one again. Um, I'm not comparing it at all, though, to that other one. I, it had the stuff I was expecting in it, the Bollywood version. Sure. <laughs> because and you just want a bunch that. of ridiculousness yeah. that's happening. And of course. It's kind of, you know, uh, family silly jokes yes. kind of in, uh, interweaved, which obviously we don't have that style in our rom-coms. There would be more of adult humor. Than, yes, this than, like, kind Night of and Day is humor. much more adult. Um it's just different audiences, obviously, especially in 2014 for for Indian audiences. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For this style, for sure, of film. I I I enjoyed it. I I would personally watch it again. I didn't think it was like amazing or anything like that. But in terms of his filmography, I because I was thinking, um, there's there's War, there's Bataan, there's this that we've seen. I'm saying, yeah. Um, uh, Siddharth is what I'm talking about here. And there's I think a, oh Fighter. I saw Fighter without you. Um. Yeah, that was one of those There's, where I couldn't or, get to the theater because it yeah, was down by the airport, exactly. right? Exactly. Yeah. Um, but uh, he's a producer on Chris Four, Tiger. Th he was a consultant on Tiger Three, Baton War. Uh, not seen a gentleman. Because he also has a very sp he's 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 an action guy, mm -hmm. but um, he all, it, it seems his through line is also kind of like when it's not action, it's kind of almost family, kind of silly vibes going yeah. on a lot of times yeah and if i had to rank them i mean if the first if if patan was all like like the, the first, first half, half of Patan was also the second half that would yeah. be my favorite me too but it did fall off yeah dramatically in the second half for, for both, both of, of us. us uh but the first half was very amazing entertaining, yeah. entertaining funny, very entertaining um all the kind of stuff and then at war we war, for the most part found entertaining it was entertaining right i would probably put I don't know, man. It, it's difficult because I think this one had. I mean, they did the, the actors did the jobs. They were both believable as a spy and um, damsel in distress kind of girl. Fun, uh, fun stunt work. Fun stunt work. Some of the ridiculousness you expect from films where it's like the bad guy's got the monologue. All he has to do is shoot the of guy, course, and, and all the bad guys can't shoot. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, we've seen it. It happens. I mean, That's, it happens in every. Action it's annoying, film. but it's also kind of endearing. It happens in every action film. Yeah, it, it especially happens in 
his action films. Um, where I, the, it I, kind of it's like almost obvious, like really they can't get you from that close. <laughs> I will say I wouldn't. While I wouldn't seek it out, yeah. If I got home the one songs day, are slappers. If I got home and Androni had Bang Bang on, I wouldn't tell her to change it, and I'd sit down and watch it. Oh with no, you tell her something. You tell God, her. I, I would. Let's bang bang. I would enjoy. <laughs> I, I would enjoy just it having been on and yeah. watching some I get of it. it. I get it. Yeah. Um, I, I that's like I said, all the songs I thought slapped. I think we had seen. Yeah, all the songs of them. are great. I think so. We is had, the score right? We had reacted to. All I think of all them. of them. Um, and the, I thought the score was really good. Cinematography was very good. Uh, in terms of his filmography, I'd probably this would probably be my favorite just overall because I think all of it was pretty okay and entertaining. Mm. Whereas War. The action was really good, sure. but the story and some of the acting weren't as, as yeah. good. Patan, second half, definitely fell off. And then Fighter, well, Fighter was actually pretty okay entertaining. I don't know if this genre is also specifically a genre that you always gravitate towards. Not action. You do gravitate. I I'm do. talking Bollywood action. Right. This yeah. specific style sure. isn't always yours. No, because admittedly. Because of some of those technicalities that they... They just do for entertainment, right? And they bother you. Yeah, uh, I get it. And and I will say the uh, yes, <laughs> when someone remakes in some way a movie that you love, you go in with very high expectations. One of the reasons saying this ad nauseum for many of you, Lal Singh Chada is so good to me. Oh yeah, because um, I love Forrest very Gump. Different kind of film, but <laughs> very very different. <laughs> but that's a very good example of taking the meat. Yeah. Of a film and keeping it intact, and then making it an Indian film, the 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 the, the changing it from the battery to the the jewel in the Indian in the crown mm. uh, lost a whole lot, and not having Paul Dano's character lost a whole lot. I don't even um, remember Paul Dano's character. We didn't have a train sequence. You lose a whole lot with that. Um, yeah, I didn't. I don't yeah, know there's just there's a there's a lot that gets. Lost and makes the story just murky, and it basically says nothing to see behind this curtain. Just watch the action and the fun, gorgeous people. Which yeah. I get. That's yeah, predominantly that, the goal. That's the Bollywood version, I think, of it. That it, it, a lot of it is a lot of style, obviously, obviously, right? Um, Predominant style over style substance. for yes. sure. Yes, but um, I don't know. I I think it was entertaining. It, it might be my favorite of Siddharth's, just because overall. I think it has the strongest of all points um, of, like, entertaining action, kind of the romance, songs, obviously. Because um, War I probably had better action, but it was also a couple years after. He probably had a much bigger budget for the action. Because sure. I remember some of those action sequences were great in War. They were. Um, but the story and some of the acting was not as strong. Correct. God, I wish the second half of Baton was uh, as good as the first half. Because I remember at, 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 at like half, I was like, this is good. Well, even, <laughs> even there's just so many things in this because I love and I know, I know Night and Day so much. I missed Hands Like Houdini. I, I she, she should press the button, not him. In Night and Day, she presses the button and that's really a betrayal of him and it hurts. And you really don't know throughout if he's a good guy or he's a bad guy. Um, mm. and Yeah, I don't remember that. Yeah, it's just they, they basically kind of took Night and Day and went, okay, we'll do that, 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 and that. And we'll, okay, that thing, will change that completely. We're not even going to include that part. And then let's just go with it. And it's kind of a remake of Night mm. and Day, kind of. So but when, I don't know why you would do that, because it's like a gift. Just redo Night and Day. Um, I don't know. Yeah, maybe he wanted to not do a strict remake. Because I, I don't know why you wouldn't. Would you say this is more of an adaption? Well, there's a lot of points. I, I think to be a remake, it like almost needs to be shot for shot. Not necessarily shot for shot, but at Adaption least is having at element. least at least moment to moment. Mm. Uh, like the first twenty minutes of it has no relationship to it whatsoever. Mm -hmm. When they first meet, they're not meeting on an airplane. They're meeting on this. this the whole dating website thing is not part of the story. Uh, it, it's her ex boyfriend who gets shot, not the annoying guy who's a boss at the office. Um, there is no grandma. There's uh, more detail about his family and why he's connected to them, and. There's much more detail of espionage, and that that takes center stage. The love story is all-encompassing, as is why he needs to preserve her and why he needs to 
get the battery to somebody and save the guy who has made the battery. Like a it's battery? Just like a, a iPhone per, battery? It's a, no, it's a perpetual battery. It's a battery this big that can generate enough electricity to power an entire city. Honestly, I'm not sure I've ever seen this movie. Because <laughs> outside of the motorcycle thing, I don't remember anything that you've said. When he kidnapped her, not struck when he drugs else. her and takes her to the to the beach. Did I fall asleep during it? You <laughs> may have. You may have. I woke up during the motorcycle scene. Yeah. I remember. You don't remember Hands Like Houdini? No. When they're that? fighting on the beach, he's behind her, and, and he says, you're, you're really good at this, but if someone grabs you from behind... Remember hands like Houdini and just drop your hands down as hard as you can and you can get away. And she does. And he says, yeah, see, that's that's really good. And later on, when she's in a fight, the bad guy gets her like this and she goes, hands like Houdini, and she gets away. It's cute. The other thing, <laughs> it's kind of anticlimactic when you mm. see Night and Day when they're on the island and she makes the phone call that gives their position away. You know how you find out mm. a freaking plane comes flying in at them shooting missiles from the plane at them and it's well, the wonderful versus just some guys running and give up their position before they even shoot you just hear a guy say there he is yeah you gotta do that yeah uh <laughs> so yeah <laughs> that's probably why i enjoyed it more because i just yeah you had no, no frame of reference I have no frame of reference outside absolutely. of the one motorcycle scene. absolutely <laughs> so i was like "Ooh, rithic's hot that's fun yeah and he was god i, I will say wait, he's a better dancer than tom cruise I, hot take and <laughs> I can almost guarantee you. Hot take. I can almost guarantee you he is faster no. than Tom Cruise. No. The stride alone, he will destroy Doesn't Tom matter. Cruise. Doesn't matter. Tom Cruise is five foot nothing. <laughs> yeah. I, I realize you did love you, Tom Cruise. Did that you watch doesn't... the Olympics? Yes. Okay. Who's the fastest woman on the planet? I don't know. Who is it? Oh, well. I didn't watch She's it. five feet tall. Okay. That doesn't mean Tom Cruise is... Just because he's shorter doesn't mean he's slower. There's no way! That was your logic. There's no your way! Your logic is because Rithik is taller, right, fine. Cruise is slower. And that's failed logic. Two million video. Tom Cruise versus yeah. Rithik Roshan 40 times. Come on. <laughs> Come on. We're going to get both of them to do that race. They're going to do a 100-yard dash. We're going to get both of them to do it. Down on the Cosmo, let you know. Who, Could you imagine? Who you think it's faster, Tom Cruise or Rithik Rocha? It's ridiculous that you think Tom Cruise is faster. I know he is. Uh, <laughs> sure, better at stunts, but who no, he's is, faster. Who isn't? Uh, better than uh, Tom Cruise? Better than well, Jackie Chan, I guess. Yeah, yeah, he'd be the best stuntman. <laughs> uh, uh, apart, here's the thing. Here's star the thing. stuntman. I think star stuntman. I think Tom Cruise is just a daredevil. Whereas Jackie can do insane things. I no, Tom's Tom's a legit stuntman, and stunt people would tell you that. Oh no, I'm not saying he's not a stuntman. I'm no. saying the difference between the two. Jackie's a martial artist. <laughs> that is true. That Jackie do, is a martial that artist. Can do insane things. Now, Tom Cruise is somebody that will just do anything. Yeah, he knows he knows martial arts, but not like Jack. Not like Jackie. Jack. His insurance companies don't Jack, want to do. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's sure. He never tells them. Yeah, I know. He just uh, does it, and they find out afterwards. Yeah, I think it was a lot of. I think it was fun, uh, especially the, the songs and their their chemistry and and them just being really really i would love to talk to rithik about his about diet, a million things about his diet routine the hell he went through uh well not yeah. only we've seen i uh, stephanie and i finished krish three mm. uh finally and it was even more yeah he was even more jacked in krish yeah. three yeah um <laughs> good lord um, you know what i'd like to ask and see but, if he's honest about as well if he was natty oh i don't think he's natty uh, <laughs> I don't, any person you see in movies is not going to be natty. Like, it would be very rare to see somebody in movies that is natty. There's nothing wrong with it, because you're not doing sports or anything like that. Um, because you just need to look a certain way. Uh, now, if you're doing, uh, bodybuilding, that would be wrong. Correct. <laughs> and it's also unhealthy. Well, so is starving yourself. Yeah, it is. It's, <laughs> it's, a, very, it's a very unhealthy thing to propagate as a as a goal to look like. You know so, who's natty? The Rock. So many. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't he's, think so. He's the, he's the most natty out I there. I don't think so. Yeah, he, 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 and so's the Liver King. Uh, both, <laughs> both very ah, natty people. Absolutely. Uh, anyway, so natural. Let us know what you thought about yeah. the movie. What should be our next Rithra Groshin Katrina Kaif films that we should watch? Yep. Uh, and uh, from this director, what other yeah, films from, should, should we, should we see? Uh, 
If you saw us on YouTube, you saw a very cut of version because of copyright reasons. If you like to see full and cut version of this and other things, you can over to Patreon. Or channel membership, so I'll put a link in the description below. Comments, you go check that out. And um, and see Night and Day if you haven't. It's fun. Yeah, it's a fun movie. Yeah. Uh, and uh, congratulations to Ashley. Oh, yeah, not yet, but she got the notification while we're watching this. She's in labor, so. Well, you probably heard it. Yeah. Uh, so congratulations at some point to her by the time you've seen this. Yep. Uh, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> It'll be a really long <laughs> That'd labor. Be a long That'd labor. be a long labor. <laughs> that would take night and day. <laughs>